6.36, Fox 45's annual Be More Healthy Expo kicks off tomorrow morning at 10. But you don't have to wait until then to see what's in store. We have a sneak peek. In fact, the theme is now's the time, right? Well, Amy Aronson is live with a preview of what you can expect. Amy. Yeah, we may not be on the Arts Alive stage right now, but we're going to get a preview of what you can see there happening tomorrow. I'm here with CJ Phillip right now, uh, who's going to give us a preview of everything that's going to be happening. A whole lot on the lineup here yes. tomorrow. Yes, folks can expect a lot. You've got puppetry, you've got magic shows, you've got uh, Noah and the Rainmakers, and he's a local drummer that everybody loves. And also, you can come and learn theater. You can learn theater games, you can learn a Broadway dance, you can learn to sing a Broadway song, and even poetry writing. We're going to have a little bit of an open mic at the Arts Alive stage. And so if you're a creative person or just want to try something, the Arts Alive stage is the place to come. Okay, cool. And you don't necessarily think of the arts as a way to get healthy and uh, bettering your mind and your body and all that good stuff, but it really is. It really is. Actually, one of my favorite quotes was from the Surgeon General. He said, you know, we're so stressed and that art has a way of unlocking joy and that helps our health. It helps us to be encouraged and uplifted. And so when we experience art in our life, it helps us all around for our whole lives and our body. Okay, great. Now you're part of the Faza fam band. You guys yes. are going to perform for us right now. Absolutely. So a favorite of the Arts Alive stage is the Faza fam family jam for parents and kids to jam together. And we've got the Faza fam band in the house and one of our families. So we're going to do a little jam if y'all Get right mind. into All it. Right. Okay. Here we go. Hey. They always have yes. a good time. Oh All right, well, the Be More Healthy Expo is tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th, at the Baltimore Convention Center from 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. The event is free, and they're still dancing. Having a great time out there. All right, the Be More Healthy Expo, just one day away, kicking off at the Baltimore Convention Center tomorrow at 10. We'll be there for it. Amy Aronson has a preview of what you can expect when you come out to join us. Amy? Yeah, Giant Food will also be there with all of us. Dr. Scott is here with us this morning showing us exactly what you guys are going to be offering there tomorrow. You're going to be working with nutritionists, so that's one, one bonus, yes. but also vaccines, screenings. You've got everything tomorrow. Yes, everything. Mm -hmm. we have, we're going to be screening for blood pressure so okay. the community can get to know their numbers. We're going to be offering a wide variety of vaccines. Uh, the hard to get Shingrix vaccine. Yeah, we're about this. <laughs> flu shot. It's still not too late to get your flu shot. Okay. Pneumonia, tetanus. Yeah. We will have it all for you. So what should people bring with them if they're planning on getting any of these vaccines or doing any of these screenings? Um, your insurance card, preferably. Okay. And we're going to be doing this for adults 18 and over. Okay. And what is the benefit of, of getting basic stuff checked, like your blood pressure, um, when coming out tomorrow? Yes, Giant wants the community to be aware of their numbers. It's important for your heart health, your overall well-being, to get it just a foundation to know where your numbers are so if you need to take any corrective action. But Giant wants the community to know that we want to partner with them so they can be more healthy. Exactly. And I'm sure you guys are going to be promoting uh, uh, healthy food options tomorrow yes. also. Yes, the nutritionist will have a cooking demo. There will be a lot of f fun surprises and, and giveaways too. Okay, awesome. We look forward to all this and more tomorrow. And you got, you'll be out there? I'll be there. Okay, yeah. cool. So look for Dr. Scott tomorrow with Giant Food if you are coming out to the Be More Healthy Expo. And if you want more information on coming out to that and everything that's going to be there, just go to our website. Go to foxbaltimore.com slash news links. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, Amy, the Be More Healthy Expo. You just heard her tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th at the Baltimore Convention Center. Starts at 10, goes until 4. The best part, it's free. 8.35, Fox 45's annual Be More Healthy Expo kicks off tomorrow morning at 10, but you don't have to wait until then to see what's in store. Yeah, in fact, Amy Aronson has been live all morning long. She's been giving us a little bit of previews of what you can expect when you hang out at this free event with all of us, Amy. You're going to be out there, too, at 10 o'clock. Yep, I'll be out there. Dr. Heller is going to be out there. We're in the simulation lab right now, which of course won't be out there, but they're still going to be talking about wounds tomorrow, wounds that you can get treated here at GBMC. Um, so what type of wounds should people come in to see you guys for if they get maybe while they're at home or at school or whatnot? 
Uh, well, good morning. good morning. Nice to see you. Uh, any kind of wound, really, that anyone has any question about, just to be clear, a wound is any open area of the skin at any part of your body. And initially, if you can treat it at home and it seems to be healing nicely without any problem, that's fantastic. But even after just a few days, we have a lot of pa patients who come and seek treatment just to make sure that if what's happening is correct and that the healing is going as planned. Okay, so what kind of things are you guys going to be doing at the expo tomorrow? What kind of things are you going to be teaching people about? We're going to be talking uh, to folks about when are wounds uh, scary, what are warning signs about when to seek further treatment, mm -hmm. um, and also how to prevent wounds from taking a really long time to heal. There are a lot okay. of uh, different medical conditions that can lessen the amount of time for uh, wounds to heal quickly. Okay, awesome. We look forward to all of that. If you guys want to come and learn more tomorrow at the Be More Healthy Expo, we've got that information on our website. Just go to foxbaltimore.com slash newslinks. Back to you guys. Oh, it's going to be a lot of fun out there. The Be More Healthy Expo is tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th, at the Baltimore Convention Center. Again, doors open at 10 a.m. We're going to be out there till 4 p.m. The event is free. No reason. Thank you, Amber. 907 and the Be More Healthy Expo is tomorrow, kicking off at the Baltimore Convention Center. Again, tomorrow morning, the place to be. Amy Aronson has a preview of what you can expect if you come join all of us there. Amy. The Be More Healthy Expo is coming up tomorrow, and it's actually a great opportunity to explore different healthcare options where you can actually build a career. So I'm here right now at GBMC with Monica this morning, who actually did that firsthand. So how did you get started? I got started back in nursing school as a tech, um, and I have been able to grow and change at, uh, throughout my career at GBMC. I've been here for 15 years. Oh, wow. Started as a as a tech, and then grew into a charge nurse, into a nurse, a unit manager, and now I'm an assistant director. And that's the great thing about healthcare. It evolves and flexes, and you can grow within its system. It's really exciting. So what was the process like? Was it difficult to move from one position to another? Not at all. It was very well supported, and any anything anything that my passion really exuded and I wanted to do I was supported at the hospital in every way and they said this is the path you should take and then they helped me get there and so it's really awesome. exciting to have that type of support here at the hospital okay great now I also want to bring in Matt because if you're watching and thinking oh I want to do something like this get into health care what opportunities are out there right now if you want to kick off your career Absolutely. So um, right now with the labor market the way it is and with our population aging and with technology the way it is and folks living longer, we have needs uh, in healthcare that are going to continue, okay. continue to grow. So um, we have needs in, um, you know, nursing, obviously, physician shortages, all of those clinical roles. But we also have needs in like entry level roles like environmental services, food, nutrition. You do not need a four year degree to enter healthcare. Actually, mm -hmm. one of our propositions of our value propositions as an employer is that we get folks in and we grow and develop them um, through the through the through their educational development that's awesome and people can learn more about this tomorrow if you come out to the be more healthy expo so if you guys want more information on that and everything you can learn and see and do there go to our website it's foxbaltimore.com slash news links back to you guys Thank you, Amy. Again, Be More Healthy Expo tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th. We're going to be out at the Baltimore Convention Center. Doors open at 10 a.m. We'll be out there through 4 p.m. The event is free, and we hope to see you out there. Thank you, Amber. 907 and the Be More Healthy Expo is tomorrow, kicking off at the Baltimore Convention Center. Again, tomorrow morning, the place to be. Amy Aronson has a preview of what you can expect if you come join all of us there. Amy. The Be More Healthy Expo is coming up tomorrow, and it's actually a great opportunity to explore different healthcare options where you can actually build a career. So I'm here right now at GBMC with Monica this morning, who actually did that firsthand. So how did you get started? I got started back in nursing school as a tech, um, and I have been able to grow and change at, at, throughout my career at GBMC. I've been here for 15 years. Oh, wow. Started as a as a tech, and then grew into a charge nurse, into a nurse a unit manager, and now I'm an assistant director. And that's the great thing about healthcare; it evolves and flexes, and you can grow within its system. It's really exciting. So, what was the process like? Was it difficult to move from one position to another? Not at all. It was very well supported, and any anything any thing that my passion really exuded and I wanted to do I was supported at the hospital in every way and they said this is the path you should take and then they helped me get there and so it's really awesome. exciting to have that type of support here at the hospital okay great now I also want to bring in Matt because if you're watching and thinking oh I want to do something like this get into health care what opportunities are out there right now if you want to kick off your career 
A absolutely. So um, right now with the labor market the way it is and with our population aging and with technology the way it is and folks living longer, we have needs uh, in healthcare that are going to continue. Okay. continue to grow so um, we have needs in um, you know nursing obviously physician shortages all of those clinical roles but we also have needs in like entry-level roles like environmental services food nutrition you do not need a four-year degree to enter healthcare. actually mm -hmm. one of our propositions of uh, our value propositions as an employer is that we get folks in and we grow and develop them um, through the through the through their educational development that's awesome and people can learn more about this tomorrow if you come out to the be more healthy expo so if you guys want more information on that and everything you can learn and see and do there. Go to our website. It's foxbaltimore.com slash newslinks. Back to you guys. Thank you, Amy. Again, Be More Healthy Expo tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th. We're going to be out at the Baltimore Convention Center. Doors open at 10 a.m. We'll be out there through 4 p.m. The event is free, and we hope to see you out there. Thank you, Amber. 9.07 and the Be More Healthy Expo is tomorrow, kicking off at the Baltimore Convention Center. Again, tomorrow morning, the place to be. Amy Aronson has a preview of what you can expect if you come join all of us there. Amy. The Be More Healthy Expo is coming up tomorrow, and it's actually a great opportunity to explore different healthcare options where you can actually build a career. So I'm here right now at GBMC with Monica this morning, who actually did that firsthand. So how did you get started? I got started back in nursing school as a tech, um, and I have been able to grow and change at, uh, throughout my career at GBMC. I've been here for 15 years, oh, wow. started as a, as a tech, and then grew into a charge nurse, into a nurse, a unit manager, and now I'm an assistant director. And that's the great thing about healthcare. It evolves and flexes, and you can grow within its system. It's really exciting. So what was the process like? Was it difficult to move from one position to another? Not at all. It was very well supported, and any, anything, any thing that my passion really exuded and I wanted to do I was supported at the hospital in every way and they said this is the path you should take and then they helped me get there and so it's really awesome. exciting to have that type of support here at the hospital okay great now I also want to bring in Matt because if you're watching and thinking oh I want to do something like this get into health care what opportunities are out there right now if you want to kick off your career Absolutely. So um, right now with the labor market the way it is and with our population aging and with technology the way it is and folks living longer, we have needs uh, in healthcare that are going to continue, okay. continue to grow. So um, we have needs in, um, you know, nursing, obviously, physician shortages, all of those clinical roles. But we also have needs in like entry level roles like environmental services, food, nutrition. You do not need a four year degree to enter healthcare. Actually, mm -hmm. one of our propositions of our our value propositions as an employer is that we get folks in and we grow and develop them um, through the through the through their educational development. That's awesome. And people can learn more about this tomorrow if you come out to the Be More Healthy Expo. So if you guys want more information on that and everything you can learn and see and do there, go to our website. It's foxbaltimore.com slash newslinks. Back to you guys. Thank you, Amy. Again, Be More Healthy Expo tomorrow, Saturday, March 16th. We're going to be out at the Baltimore Convention Center. Doors open at 10 a.m. We'll be out there through 4 p.m. The event is free, and we hope to see you out there.